Hi Aries, this is your mid-month mini reading and also we have a full moon in Scorpio. So it's kind of thinking about that as well. We've got a full moon lunar eclipse in Scorpio, actually. Full moon lunar eclipse in Scorpio. <sighs> Spiritual big jobs, yep. I think it's going to be quite a big one, as the actress said to the bishop. I really do. So what do we need to know for you? This is Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising or Venus. What do we need to know? Oh my God. Oh my God. Okay. Quite a lot in the realm of love for you, Aries, to be honest. Um, overall energy card, the gorgeous Two of Cups absolutely love this partnership card relationship card it's the kind of kind of relationship where two people are actually into it do you know what i mean they've both brought a cup the angel blesses it and yet okay those of you that may be feeling a bit cynical about it we've got the ace of cups in the reverse as well okay you've got a lot of cups in this reading We've got the Ace of Cups in the reverse. Let me just have a flip with the camera and show you the cards. Because it's a really interesting set of cards. So you can see here we've got our Two of Cups overall energy card at the top of the deck. And then the Ace of Cups here, which signals that something, there was a love that was once kind of flipped or gone or spilt or there's been some difficult emotion or after a long time of being on your own or a long time of feeling sad about something, this comes in. And then we also have the gorgeous, glorious 10 of cups as well, okay? It feels like lost love, gained love, lost love, gained love. Mercury being retrograde at the same time as a full moon lunar eclipse in Scorpio, it's backwards and forwards all the way. It's it's almost not even backwards and forwards. I feel like it's some quantum scattering of energy where you're kind of in the future, you're in the past. It's a sidestep. It feels like a sort of weird retrograde line dance of love. Okay, there you go. I'm doing my weird retrograde line dance of love. So expect X's to come out of the woodwork. Expect thoughts about people and feelings you thought were long buried but also expect connection. Get your disco pants on, get yourself out there, okay? In whichever way people get themselves out there because there's something for you here. The Two of Cups is not to be kicked out of bed for eating crisps. It's a sweetheart of a card. I really like this energy and the Page of Swords is my card for like the internet, okay? We've got justice in reverse. We've got the four of wands in reverse. Something in the past just wasn't right. Or even something now just isn't right. But there is something so much better over the horizon, okay? Somewhere over the rainbow for you, Aries. Three of wands. Things are growing at the same time that other things are dying out, okay? If you were a garden, you'd be doing some really good pruning and the rest would be coming into bloom, okay? Let's have some love oracle cards for you. Okay, love oracle cards. Ooh, oh, yes. Okay. And Aries, do sign up for my new newsletter as well. I've just learned how to do a newsletter properly. And if you go in the description box and waggle down a bit, you can sign up for it. My free newsletter with kind of news and tips and whatever's going on at Gemstone Towers. Okay. Oh God almighty, I'm on the wrong camera. Codependency. This is something about that Ace of Cups. Something flipped, okay? It could be about addiction, but it's usually about a relationship where the chemistry, I was gonna say the chemistry is off, but I reckon the chemistry is on, but the rest of it hasn't been, okay? And there's like a course correction coming. We have keep an open mind. Your soulmate might differ from your usual types and expectations. So if you're dating or you're, on, you're online dating, move the sliders, 
move the sliders for a larger geographical area, a different age range, taller, shorter, whatever it is, okay? And playfulness, you're an Aries, okay? You're really good at this, it's a fire sign thing. Don't forget to enjoy yourself as well. The energy is really tricky at the moment, but also humour normally gets Aries through. Leave me a comment, let me know how that, <coughs> let me know how that resonates. And also check out the newsletter and any other videos in the description box below. See you soon. Namaste.